My name is Rhapsody and welcome to The Hex. The Hex builds itself as a murder mystery, but having played the previous game, Pony Island, from the same creator, Daniel Mullins, I'm going to guess that it's a lot deeper than that. I'll leave it at that and we can explore it together, but at the very top here, there's one thing that I would like to mention, that is that some sections of this game contain flashing lights, so those with photosensitivity should consider watching at their own risk. Unfortunately, I don't know when those flashing lights would appear, so I cannot really uh, move around that. I am going to reset so that it will do the opening message. In a dark, forgotten corner of the video game universe, a storm is raging. And then we immediately get back in. The six pint in. Let's go in. Okay, we get to control the world's oldest man as he hobbles his way towards a... Well, actually, it doesn't look like hobbles. That looks like a wheelchair right now. <coughs> Hello? What? Slow down! You're telling me that one of my patrons is planning a... A murder, you say? But... Which one? H Hello? Hmm. Hey! Listen up! I just got a disturbing call. Someone in this room is planning a murder. Now I mean to get to the bottom of this. You, uh, weasel kid. Come over here. Let's talk. So the trailer for this game seems to show that each of these different characters that exists in the bar is based on broadly a type of genre of game. So the weasel kid is platformer. Uh, we also have the apocalyptic survivor here, who's probably a survival game. Do you hear what the old guy said? Bartender wanted a word, I reckon. Space Marine, obviously sci-fi. So what are you, the murderer? Why don't you talk to the barkeep before dishing out accusations? I don't know what kind of voice I was going for there. Uh, the first person perspective? And what a... I love that the first person perspective only has hands and feet. Usually they don't have feet either. And what a... Just go talk to him. And what a... Just go talk to him. Alright, so I believe fighting game and then general fantasy are the other two genres with which we're working currently. Now, having played previous title, Singular, uh, by this developer, I understand that a lot of the point is to explore and try things. All right, there's a coin there, throw it in. <laughs> Not enough. Uh... Can take down the bottles from the shelf and move them. Alright, let's just go into the conversation first. We'll get directed afterwards if we need it. What is... Sorry. <laughs> Wrong character. Look, kid. Between you and me, you're the only one I trust here. I want you to talk to a few of these characters. See if any will fess up. The voices for the main characters, by the way, are going to consistently change. Seven main characters. I'm going to forget the voices from time to time. All right, let's see if we can get anyone to fess up. Hey, Creed, you planning to murder? M murder? Sure. So you admit... Dust Bowl Danny, he'll get a bandit, that old rat fat... This was the previous voice. I'll get him one day. That was the voice I was going for. So we meet again. Quiet! We're not supposed to know each other. Oh, right, um... The name's Lazarus, kid, and I'm a space marine. Uh, very nice to meet you, Lazarus. Likewise. Right, we should probably go for multiple prompts on each character, though. There was a tall Jane, too. Voices are going to consistently change, but it's either that or don't read at all. What's your story, man? You're from a walking simulator or something? Barely even textured, dude. And who are you supposed to be? I am a high elf sorceress, kid. Watch yourself. And what kind of magic do you practice anyways? None of your business. 
You look strong enough to kill someone. What are you up to? Watch your mouth, kid. I'm from a cooking game. I'm no killer. <laughs> I love that. Subvert expectations. You're a chef? You look more like a fighter. Turns out I can be both. The barkeep here pays me to cook. Uh, anything else we can get here? What, you've never heard of Super Weasel Kid? Super Mario Brothers, Super Meat Boy, that kind of formatting for platforming characters is quite common. Anyone else? And the worm. Mm, yes. Mm, yes. Dot, dot, dot. Yeah, I think we're now at the point we get talking back. So, did anyone say anything? Um, no, man. That was kind of a waste of... Yeah, I didn't think so. At least you're acquainted now. I want you to make your way upstairs. Behind the first door on the second floor, there's a very important key up there. Who? Oh! I almost forgot to give you the- uh, give the old elevator a jump start. Let me just- uh. That should do it. Go get me that key. Alright, dude, you got it. Today's special is stro uh, hot strawberry pie. There's the kitchen that I cannot currently enter. Alright, so that's for calling the lift. So it's the first door on the second floor. Ah, uh, okay. Is it ground one, two, or is it one, two, three? I'm going to assume it's one, two, three, because that door seems locked. Never mind, I can't go up. I was wrong. Okay, can't interact with any of those. Gosh, this is going to be a, a lot of clicking on my part, I'm going to assume. I can't even open the door! Oh, uh, never mind. It's going to be some sort of a platform or puzzle behind there, right? I think I just did some- Oh no, I just opened this! Hey, coins! Alright. There's a coin up there as well. Okay. I'm gonna try and keep an eye out for the coins. What was it? So it was, uh, 225. Each of these coins appears to be a quarter, because the first one took the first down by 25. So I've already got four? That's a dollar? So I only need five more. Excellent. Just gonna try and keep an eye out for those. Take that down, put it back up, close for repairs. Oh. Can I take soda between areas? Mr. R. McLean. Isn't it John McLean for the Hmm. Alright. Ms. Stormblaze. Oh, okay, never mind. It's actually probably Chef Rice. Yeah, no, they are actually the individual characters downstairs, I believe. Can I go in the wrong direction for something? No? There's some eyes in the dark there. But we've made our way into the room. Take that, thank you. Hey! There was one hiding under the ale. I was wondering where that was going to happen. Well, here's a stupid key. I guess I'd better bring it back to the old barkeep. Oh, jeez. Is that... blood? Right, 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 right. Any other interactables in the room? I'm thinking there's probably a way to open this curtain. However, I guess I'm not entirely certain. Thumbs down! And we get murdered. Perfect. So we found out who the victim is. <laughs> Super Weasel Kid. The good old days. Oh, hell yeah. Click the jump. All right. Yeah, no, I've played a platform for my time. Super Weasel Kid. My, how you've grown. Hi, Mr. Shrewd. Hi. Well, without further ado, welcome to a grand adventure. Here you can jump, run, and maybe even soar among the... Uh, too quick. Uh, I'll be looking out for you, kid. Cool. I'm going to have to speak a lot faster. Okay, so wait. Oh, I actually have to pop them individually if I want to collect them. Cool. Just making sure I'm not missing any secrets. I know this kind of game. Secrets are important. Oh, okay. So you've got a triple jump mechanic here. There we go. Ah. You can do it in place. So it's not like the... 
first Super Mario one. There we go. Cool. Oh, yikes! Almost took damage there. But it appears the ground came up to greet me. Is this a you can't die scenario kind of thing? You're wearing me out, kid. Try to stay out of the spikes. Oh, sorry, Mr. Shrewd. Oh, I couldn't stay mad at you. Okay, so it's the Shrewd that's doing it for us. Time for the Goombas. I mean, uh, the non-copyright infringing mushroom enemies. Sorry. Whew. Hello, cat. Hi there. Who are you? Oh, young weasel. You interrupted my musings. S sorry. Fear not. You are the least of my woes. My boundless wisdom wasted here for a petty side quest. A quest? Yes, young weasel. For coins. Bring me 50. And to you, a secret I will reveal. You have 39 right now. Mm -hmm. Excellent. No! Okay, Mr. Shrewd is actually like straight up looking out for us at all times. Like it, love it. There's our 50. Let's go back. Hey, show me the secret. Hi, I got the coins. Young Weasel, then I will tell you my secret. The source of true happiness lies with it. No! I cannot. Huh? I cannot simply spout nonsense as a reward? As I was supposed to? Here's a real secret. This game was built on the ashes of another. Alas, I've said too much. Can I get like clarification on that? What? What? Sarsaparilla! That is all, young weasel. Alrighty then. First hint that the game is going to do something odd. It didn't take Pony Island that long to get real weird. <laughs> and it got real weird in a really cool way. Which is kind of the thing I'm hoping for here as well. Unfortunately, by the very nature of this game, I can't really test it off screen without ruining it for myself. It's like how you can't really pitch Undertale to anyone without ruining Undertale for that person that you pitch it to. Hang on, I'm gonna jump on your head and try and get over the castle. Apparently that's a thing I was supposed to do. Wait, one more word of advice. I know I'm a bother. You're special, kid. But don't let it get to your head. That's not advice. What do I do with that? Aha. Uh -huh. That's going to be the ashes of the previous game accessible here if I have to. <laughs> Retro Game Lover. 21 products in their account and 9 reviews. Recommended. One hour on reco uh, record. No name is as big as Super Weasel Kid for platformer games. The very fist entry to the series does not disappoint. Love, Mr. Shrewd. Was this review helpful? Apparently, 83% of people found so. 6.2 hours on record. Pure childlike joy from straight... Whoa! Hang on! Is it pulling names from... I, I don't know if I know that person, but... Stray is on my friends list. Pure childlike joy. Playing Super Weasel Kid again is like, well, being a kid again. Yeah, no, it's definitely, it's definitely pulling from my Steam list. All right. 10 out of 10. Would relive childhood again. Super Weasel Kid. All right. Lolash. Hey, Lolash, what's up, my dude? Uh, Lionel's early work is amongst his best. Shame the later entries in the series didn't quite match the original Super Weasel Kid. Okay. I think that's slightly out of my reach, right? Yeah, it is. 
Mm. Ah ha ha! Never mind. All right. Ms. Machine says, uh, this game is so forgiving in a good way. Who needs a game over screen anyways? A lot of people define what a game is by its lost state. I don't necessarily agree with that because there are a lot of games that I really like that you can't really lose in. They're kind of just narrative experiences that you find your way through. I understand not everyone holds the same opinion on that type of game, but I do. Trying to keep an eye out because I don't want to miss anything super cool. Uh, generic says, love to the game, but what was the point of the coins? Yeah, that's what I'm wondering right now as well. Wait, what says, love SWK, super weasel kit. Uh, the experience of grabbing the coins is its own reward. Is it now? What's happening? We seem to be like tickling the mountain whenever we jump on that flower. I wouldn't be surprised if there was a certain amount of jumps that triggers that, but I'm going to try and not over go into trying to explore those kinds of things because otherwise I would spend 15 minutes on the opening screen. So what is this? Click for a long time? Oh, you can just hold down the... Oh, one word. Uplifting. Ah, ha, ha. Okay. That one's from Skittles. Oh, back. Hey, what's up, Arvac? Haven't talked to you in a while. The best game in the SWK series by so, 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 so much. Uh, Kriet says, I can't believe this 12-year-old made this. Lionel is a genius. We've got Super Weasel Kid up here. Can't stop coming back. The game just makes me happy. That is literally Super Weasel Kid. Uh, down we've got Carla. Uh, can't believe my friend Lionel made this game. He's the best. Mind of Science says, such a sublime experience. Jim, mate. Uh, <laughs> says, only a few games I cherish as much as Super Weasel Kid. We've got CD saying, oh boy, I love this game. Jeff says, highly recommended Heart Super Weasel Kid. Awkward Malevolence says, joyous occasion to play SWK. Veritor says, my all-time favorite. Uh, Chunky Bungus says, best game. Not sure that's a person on my friends list. I think, they're, I think they're mixed in. Some are in my friends list, some are not. Okay, that didn't exactly work the way that I kind of intended it to. It's okay, kid. It doesn't hurt that much. Hey, there we go. That's what I was looking for. So is this back in modern times? Look at you, you poor fool. Well, what? Oh, to be replaced by such mediocrity. Who are you? You should take better care of Mr. Shrewd. He's getting older. Stop saying scary things. Very well. Goodbye for now. Whoa. What the, the, okay. I'm going to stop jumping on top of uh, Mr. Trude's head. Super Weasel Kid 2. Radical Road. The long-awaited sequel. Oh, we've got lives in this. Lives. Lives. Sorry. Hey, kid. Welcome to the uh, Radical Road. I'm hyped. Right, of course. I have to let you know, this asphalt is tough for me to break through. I won't be able to help as much as I used to. It's okay, Mr. Shrewd. I can handle it now. Well, all right. If you say so, out of my way, man. Hell yeah. All right. Old Greg. Oh, Greg says uh, it's not quite what we expected for a sequel, but I still enjoyed SWK. Uh-uh, haters get at me. That review was 38% helpful. Okay, people appear not to like this game in the in-universe fiction. Mistara says, uh, can't help but be disappointed. Whoa, not cool, dude. Falling into spikes and other hazards will cause you to lose life, lose too much life, and it's game over, bro. Uh, that PD90 Global Elite? No! Ah! Ah! I can't even... I can't even read them before they disappear. Mash click to punch. Oh, okay. So to 
different combat system now. All right, uh, Bendito says, I liked the combat in Rad Road because the original didn't even have combat. That's certainly a point. Uh, Lix says, Rad Road is all right, just doesn't have the same magic. Uh, Yoshi says, wish I could give it a half thumb up, but DBH was disappointed in its combat system, trying to like commit them to memory really quickly. All right, I'm going to have to stop reading those because they might just disappear while I'm on them, right? DJ says, regardless of other criticism, you have to admit the music is radical. Yes, yeah, that's, that's a good point. And also the right person to be making it. That point in particular. Yeah. Nothing going on up there. Yeah. Trying to make sure I'm not missing out on any secrets. Seems like there should have been something. I'm not going to jump on your head here. Oh, take the sign Radical Road with me. Skating time. All right. I don't really know what genre went closest to this. Morsha says Radical. Oh, we still have to fight them while we're on the board. Damn. Not that good from Backlash. On oh, almost to the bottom of the mountain. It's pretty okay, says Yoshi. Hey, no, 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 no. No, my coins. My coins. Damn it. I wanted all of those really badly. Do you still trust him? <laughs> you again. You see what people are saying, right? They don't like you as much as they used to. I don't care what people think, man. Why do you fi why do I find that so unconvincing? All right, what's in the third? Super Weasel Kid 09, Super Eat, uh huh. Right. That's a Sonic, Sonic 06 kind of thing, right? The one uh, labeled after the year is the worst. Uh, hey, kid. Welcome to the brand new uh, adventure. Ooh, who the heck are you? Where's Mr. Shrewd? Shrewd. Never heard of him. You've never heard of him? Who are you? I'm Mr. Squirrel. All right, Mr. Squirrel, now you listen. No, you listen to me, kid. They hired me to talk, so I'm gonna talk. Ahem. Welcome to a brand new adventure. Here you can run, jump, maybe even soar. Now knock yourself out. Okay. Seems like there was a graphical glitch there for a moment. Uh, Yave says, so what the hell is this? Yeah, there's a lot of graphical glitches going on, which I have to imagine is uh, emblematic of something. The decline of quality in series over time, in general. What's that? Wait a second. No, what it? What is that message up there trying to say? Uh, something journey. Or is it upside down? Nope. Alright, I can pop that as many times as I like and I'm not going to be able to collect it. Harmless, he sold out and did it for cheap. Uh, is this a port? Is this a sequel? It's terrible. Pure, unadulterated garbage. So Lionel sold the rights of SWK to f Game Funa, and you're surprised that it's bad. Game Funa, infam infamous rather for horrible ports and remasters, has done it again. When will developers stop continuing to give them money? Right. 
I want to see the... I want to see the sorcerers from the first one. Oh, uh, gosh. All right, we're actually getting really close to death. We're going to have to watch ourselves a little bit here. It's a buggy mess. I feel like I've been robbed. How do I get a refund? Because this game is a scam. Uh, <laughs> really great resurrection of the Super Weasel Kid franchise. Game Funa hit it out of the park again. From Game Funa Rob. Uh huh. That's what I imagine the snoring sounds like now. Whoa! All right. Nothing redeemable here. Hey, it's Igni. Uh, we all thought SWK was going back to its roots after the uh-uh. Game Gabster says, poor Super Weasel Kid, I miss the old days. Cedro says, uh, worst Super Weasel Kid game ever. Uh, WTF Game Funa, WTF Lionel. SheLab says, just swaz. Carla says, Lionel, what is this? Our jump height is significantly reduced. Tim says, kind of cliche, but they don't make them like they used to. The first SWK was a masterpiece. This is a piece of... Censored. Tramato says, how do I get a refund? Because this game is a scam. Trash by Kizza. Hopeless? What were they thinking? All right, I'm going to need to find a way to get... There we go. Back up. Game is a travesty from Flaming Salute. Sinspark says, I have yet another negative review to add to the pile. SWK has gone so far. Tramato says something. Hey, my partner says, uh, this was an introduction to the series. All I can say is Super Weasel Kid sucks. And now it's time to go into the abyss. Rest in peace, Alfred Shrewd. Off to the left there. All right, now where's the Kickstarter revival of the game that is also lambasted, naturally? That was quite a fall. This key better be worth it. For the moment, my name has been Rhapsody. The name of the game has been The Hex. There is a playlist in the description down below with all of my content on this game, past, present, and future. So I guess present and future. As well as to the previous game by the same creator, being Pony Island by Daniel Mullins Games. There's also a link to the Steam store page so you can pick up and play the game for yourself if you would like to do so. Hopefully you've been enjoying yourselves and hopefully we'll see you next time.